The Enfield Haunting In the quiet suburbs of Enfield, London, during the late 1970s, a council house stood as a reluctant host to an eerie tale that would soon grip the entire community. Peggy Hodgson and her four children inhabited the home, blissfully unaware of the malevolent force lying in wait. Strange occurrences began innocently, faint whispers, mysterious creaks in the night, and misplaced household items. But as the days passed, the unseen entity grew bolder. One evening, as the clock struck midnight, an unearthly force started toying with the furniture. Chairs shuffled across the room, and heavy cabinets levitated, defying the laws of physics. Terrified, the Hodgson family could only watch in horror as their home turned into a haunted playground. Desperate for answers and help, Peggy sought out paranormal investigators, Morris Gross and Guy Lyon Playfair. They arrived at the scene and bore witness to the haunting events. The air was thick with fear and disbelief, as the ghostly presence continued its relentless torment. The children, particularly Janet, bore the brunt of the haunting. The entity seemed to single her out, throwing her across rooms, contorting her body in unimaginable ways. The supernatural forces seemed to have a cruel fascination with the vulnerable. As the investigators delved deeper, skeptics arose, doubting the authenticity of the haunting. Some whispered that the children were the puppeteers, orchestrating an elaborate hoax. But amidst the skepticism, the fear endured, leaving an indelible mark on those who witnessed the chilling events. To this day, the tale of the Enfield poltergeist haunts the annals of paranormal law, leaving behind unanswered questions and a shiver down the spine of anyone who dares to explore its mysteries. Though decades have passed since those chilling nights in Enfield, the tale of the poltergeist continues to echo through the corridors of time. The Hodgson family moved on, leaving behind a house, guard by the supernatural and hearts forever changed by the terror they endured. The paranormal investigators, Gross and Playfair, could never shake the memory of the events they witnessed. The inexplicable happenings challenged their beliefs and left a lasting impression on their lives. But what of the malevolent force that once roamed the halls of that house? Its true nature remains an enigma. Some believe it was a vengeful spirit, while others think it was a manifestation of the darkness within human souls. Whatever the case, the Enfield poltergeist remains a harrowing tale, a reminder that the line between the known and the unknown is thin, and that sometimes, the shadows hold secrets that defy explanation. The house still stands, silent witness to the horrors of that time, awaiting its next chapter in the annals of the unexplained. Sleep well. Share your own encounters with the unknown in the comments or email us at whispersdarkone at gmail.com.